I was so consumed by keeping my face clean, keeping my hands clean, not touching my face. It just took over my life. I used to feel like I needed to apologise for how I looked. I remember it was when it was getting to a point where the first thought when I woke up in the morning was look in the mirror, are they gone yet? There were times when I was like, I just don't want to leave the house and no one should live like that, no one should. I would want to wear my, my hair all over my face so that people couldn't see me from the side and no one can see them, you cover them so well, no one can see them, but I knew that they were there and I think that's the thing that really sort of zaps your confidence. So I mentally prepare myself when my skin is not looking its best by just looking after myself. That is the biggest gift that I can give myself. I try and eat well, I'm trying to drink a lot more water. As an influencer, I would like to empower people in the way that they look, just by letting them know that the things that make them them are the things that make them unique and beautiful in their own right. It doesn't define you as a person. The words no more hiding to me mean stripping all of this back, so the straightened hair, the foundation, the primer, the powder, getting rid of all of that and just embracing who we are.